Hey everybody, it's me, Kentucky Hero 201. Today, we all will, we will be reviewing the Season 2 of Asaka Ano Omidi or Kangaroo Season 2 Let Mate at Sea. Yes, you heard me right. Well, if you haven't heard of this anime yet, check out my last video where I discuss and review Season 1. So, Kangaroo Season 2 Let's Meet at Sea is a sequel to the 250 anime series Kenta Collection Kangaroo, which is based on the browser game of the same name. The second season describes the fleet girl who are anthropomorphic warships of the Imperial Japanese Navy fighting against the Absol fleet. An, an unknown enemy that puts the world in great danger. This season focuses on a new seat of fleet girls with Shiku who is assigned a destroyer in the first striking force third division and other fleet girls including familiar faces from the first season. The Fleet Girl are on the defense as the season starts. However, the war against the Abelzol fleet has turned into favor against them, and the army has suffered heavy losses, reducing the fleet's number. Shiga and her squadron are resigned to a dangerous mission to function as a dis. For mercenary force ahead of their operations. They are bound to be sent on a suicide mission to draw the Bizzles as the season progresses. Shiku's squadron discovers more about the Bizzles in the reasons for fighting. In the Progress. They learn that the conflict is far bigger than they thought, and there are hidden, but powerful forces that are at play, adding a touch of mystery to the series. The second series focuses mainly on the significances of teamwork and friendship. Each of them, them most depend on the one another to live and finish the missions. They also develop strong relationship of the admirals who become the mentors and advisors. Another important aspect of the season two is hope. Hope that even in the darkness times she could in the another fleet girls where there will always be light. They stand for what is right even when the chances are not in the favor which was a slight to see. In the end, she could in the squadron must face the greatest challenge yet a massive abyssal fleet that Threaten to overwhelm them. They must employ all the scare and train to survive and defend the country from external enemies. Shuku and another fleet girl also face a series of personal challenges throughout the season where she is required to have faith in her instructs in herself. This was a good chance as it's for heavily in connecting the viewer to the characters. T to to the fan who enjoy watching action, military, and cyber genres, you should definitely watch the Kangaroo season two. May let's may I see in fact it is a good sequel that takes the first season to into considerations. Moreover, the play is well placed, well paced, and completely, and the characters are developed in a likable. Additionally, the fighting scenes between the Flicker and Basils 
are well directed and spectacular to look at. However, this might not be attractive to the new audiences since it is only interest to someone who has already known the franchise. So I will give it an AL10, which means that it proved it that is a good secret that evaluate the series even further and I hope we will get to see more in the future. Thank you for watching this. I hope you see you on the next upload.